Now I'm going to prepare a dish using Albert Bartlett Elfi Potatoes. It's a potato broth flavoured with spinach, herbs and chicken crackling. So the first job is the chicken crackling and I'm using chicken skin. Now chicken skin, you can ask your butcher to put them aside for you. Most butchers won't charge you for it, but if they do, it should be really cheap. Now you get the chicken skin, just add a bit of sea salt to them, like so, like you would pork crackling. It needs a lot of salt. So once it's seasoned, you lay them out flat on a baking sheet lined with greaseproof paper. Another piece of greaseproof paper over the top. And then I like to put on top another tray just to keep it nice and flat. So that goes in the oven at about 160 degrees for 10 minutes until they're nice and crispy. So whilst the chicken skins are becoming crackling and crisping up and cooking, we can chop up the potatoes. So we'll cube up the potato and you can see this wonderful flesh. It is lovely and yellow, rich and creamy. This elfy potato is quite special. Yellow skinned, different texture to the rooster, but equally as tasty. So for this particular dish, which is a potato broth, it just adds more creaminess. We dice it up into nice regular cubes and into some water seasoned with just salt. So whilst the potatoes are cooking, now it's time to pick the herbs. Now we've got baby leaf spinach here, beautiful succulent baby leaf spinach, washed of course, flat leaf parsley, a generous handful. And this is going to be full of flavour. This broth is just bags and bags of flavour. Tarragon. Now if you don't like aniseed, you can do without the tarragon. But I think it really just adds great little kick of aniseed pungency to it. And then finally some chives. Beautiful chives. I just roughly chop some of the chives there. I'm just going to roughly chop all the herbs. Let's check these potatoes. Mm. They're cooked. Right. So we need to drain the potato. So there we go. They're cooked and as you can see they're holding together and that is the beauty of the elfy potato. So with this cooking liquid we're going to make the broth. Put all our herbs into the blender with the spinach and this hot potato broth. Lid on top and then just put a cloth on top of that in case. and blitz it up until it is completely smooth. Right, let's get the chicken skins. I mean, they smell of roast chicken. We all fight over the crispy chicken skin on the roast chicken. Now we take a bowl to serve. You can see the potatoes are still piping hot. That lovely vibrant broth and elfy potatoes are so good at taking on board lots of flavour. Finish it off with some lovely crispy chicken crackling. Just a drizzle of olive oil on the soup itself. On that lovely broth, a few little droplets of olive oil. 
And there we have it, a lovely elfy potato broth with herbs, spinach, and chicken crackling. <laughs>